of a democratic and free society in which all persons live together in harmony and with equal opportunity. We're heading for a spot on the old main road, the R103, five kilometers outside the town of Awek in KwaZulu-Natal. And it's a place of historical importance, not only for South Africa, but for the world. Nelson Mandela was arrested on the 5th of August, 1962. A long walk continues. Well, uh, yeah. On that date, Mandela had been on the run for over 17 months. Armed police acting on a tip-off set up a roadblock on the spot. And Nelson Mandela, who was dressed up in disguise as a chauffeur, driving a black Boston Westminster, was arrested and spent the next 27 years of his life in prison. After wandering through the Educational Centre and Museum, walk along the path which represents Mandela's long walk to freedom. There are 27 steel signposts along the way, each one representing a year of his imprisonment. Towards the steel sculpture, as you walk towards it, it gradually comes into focus until at a point 30 meters from the monument, the face of Nelson Mandela comes into focus. Whatever your politics, left or right, center, whatever your, your race, doesn't really matter. This is a guy that spent 27 years in prison for his belief. So whatever your political or other beliefs, you have to respect this man. Walking back now from the sculpture, back up the path. And I've got to say, it's a very sobering moment. I'm glad I've done this. Deep gratitude. Generous praise that has often been given to me as an individual. And let me state this. To the extent that, that I've been able to achieve anything, I know that this is because I am the product of the people of South Africa.